guys, what's up? Welcome back to my channel. Today is day three of Navrangi Navratri, and today's color is red. So this makeup look is a little more on the subtle side. I would want to say like the eye look is not as dramatic as the other day's eye look. Uh, but the lips are the main talking. You know, I love a red lip. I hope you guys enjoy this look. If you do, then please don't forget to hit that like button. If you are new to this channel, then make sure you hit the subscribe button. For this entire nine days of Navratri, I am uploading every single day. So click on the bell icon right next to it so that you're notified for these nine days and also for the videos that I upload after that. For now, if you want to see how I got this look, then please keep on watching. Okay, so I'm starting with the Revolution Pro Fix Illuminating Makeup Fixer as my primer. Also spritzing a little bit on my sponge because I'm using the Huda Beauty Foundation, the four filter one, and this is very very matte. So I needed a dewy base for good blending. I'm stippling this on my skin. I'm using the shade brown sugar, but it's a little too light for me. So I'm dragging it down my neck to match the shade perfectly. For concealer, I'm using the LA Girl Pro Conceal HD in the shade medium beige. Applying it on the usual areas like you can see and then blending it in with the Real Techniques sponge. For powder, I'm using the e.l.f. Translucent Setting Powder. I'm just placing this on my face with this Kabuki brush from Amazon. For bronzer, I'm using the ColourPop Pressed Powder Bronzer in the shade Rodeo Drive. Taking this on the back to one four brush and just stippling this in the usual areas. Also trying to contour my nose with the same brush, very coarsely. For blush and highlight, I'm using this Color Bar uh, Feel the Rain Duo Blush and Highlight. Uh, taking the blush, which is a lovely mauve pink color, one of my favorite blushes, and this rose gold highlight, which is not that reflective, but it I try to make do with this. Once again, to fix my face in place, I'm using the Revolution Pro Fix Illuminating Fixer and picking up any excess product with the Real Techniques sponge. For my brows, I'm using the Maybelline Fashion Brow Pomade. The only disadvantage of this is you cannot sharpen it. So I'm very coarsely placing the product and then brushing it through with a spoolie brush. For my eyes, I'm using the Elf Mad for Matte Eyeshadow Palette, taking these two brown shades on the Pack 204 Dense Packing Brush and just placing it all over the lid and in the crease. I'm going in with just one shade for this look. For eyeliner, I'm using the Miniso 3 in 1 eyeliner. This is a grey variant, but it appears really, really black on the eyes. And I'm trying to draw a little thicker than usual uh, liner as well as a wing because uh, there wasn't much going on on the eyes otherwise. Curling my lashes before I apply mascara. I'm using the Tarte Lights Camera Lashes Mascara and applying this on my top as well as bottom lashes. For Kajal, I'm using the Nykaa Rock the Line Kajal. To add a little more shine to the look, I'm taking this Miss Claire Pearl Eyeliner in the shade Brown and I'm outlining the black eyeliner with it. If you go wrong in some places, you can always like fill in with the black eyeliner like I'm doing here. So you don't need to worry, uh, it is a little tricky but it adds a little something to the eye. For falsies, I'm using the Glomia Beauty Lashes in the style Halo. For lipstick, I'm using my favorite red lipstick which is the Wet n Wild Mega Last Liquid Lipstick in the shade Missy and Fierce. To complete this look, I'm just going to open my hair. I forgot to actually blend out my lower lash line. So taking the same browns of my crease on the bottom lash as well. Wearing these beautiful earrings I got from the store uh, Saatchi in Santa Cruz, uh, Mumbai. And uh, my kurti is uh, borrowed from my friend Roshni. So I will ask her from where she got it and leave it in the description section. To do a little something with my hair, even though I know I suck at doing my hair, just twisting it up on the side and then adding some bobby pins and taking all the hair on one side of my shoulder. That's it guys, this completes the entire look. I hope you guys enjoyed this subtle, very simple makeup look for the Navratri season. 
if you did actually like this video don't forget to hit the like button if you're new to my channel then don't forget to hit the subscribe button leave your thoughts in the comments below and i will see you tomorrow for the next day of navrangi navratri bye guys love you all